So I got really fed up with the Polestar 2 that is breaking down all the time. And I swapped it with this new Volkswagen ID3 first. It's a bit noisy in here. If you enjoy my content, please consider to hit like and subscribe, that's always highly appreciated. So I got really fed up with the Polestar 2 that is breaking down all the time and I swapped it with this new Volkswagen ID3 first. Uh, no, I didn't. I'm just kidding. Uh, so I delivered my Polestar 2 for service today to do the, the recall update, uh, which includes changing the inverters and uh, the HVCH high voltage coolant heater and they're also updating the software to the latest version so it's going to be good uh, and when I delivered my Polestar I got this ID3 uh, as a loaner car I'm not going to review it but it's a nice car it's um, it's not the Polestar 2 so Oh no, the consumption is really bad on this car. 37.3. Oh my god. I'm not sure what it is. It's uh, it's a nice little car. It's it feels a bit like the the Nissan Leaf we have. The Leaf is uh oh. Oops. We have a Nissan Leaf, uh, the 40 kilowatt version from 2018, and to be honest, the ID3 is pretty similar in. For me, it was well, at least the driving experience is is pretty pretty similar. How you sit and everything, even the looks of it is kind of similar. Uh, it's not a bad thing because the Nissan Leaf is a great car. Uh, and the ID3 is kind of a mix between the the Nissan Leaf and and the BMW i3. Yeah. It's like it's like the Nissan Leaf and the i3 met somewhere and had some, you know, sexy time and then this this is the result of it. Kind of a upgraded version of both. Hmm, yeah, so, but it's a good car, I guess. It's a nice car, it's a... Nothing I want. <laughs> they got a nice place for cup holders. This is better than the Polestar 2, definitely. Maybe I should change the car. Yeah, because this is kind of... Phone charger. So... All this space here, and here, and here, and here, and here. You miss out with the Polestar too, but that's how it is. I wish the Polestar engineers would have made the part here better, so that so that you can have two cups when you are driving. But who cares? When you drive something really cool. So I just want my Polestar 2 back because yeah, the driving experience is miles ahead and uh, everything else of course. So I will 
make another video when the Polestar 2 is back uh, from service, from the updates. Uh, they said it would take a day, so I guess I will have it back either today or tomorrow. Uh, we'll see. When I get it back, I'll do a dry uh, comparison. It's kind of sketchy weather right now with rain and snow and zero degrees outside. So it's kind of the roads are probably slippery and everything, but I'll do a test my regular route uh, just to compare I don't know consumption if it's getting better or worse with the updated high voltage coolant heater and the software and everything inverters we'll see how it goes um, yeah so that was just a short update I will never change my Polestar 2 uh, with the ID3 now that's it for now so if you enjoy my content please consider to hit like and subscribe that's always appreciated see you